Today we're going to go over how to use the test terminals on these train units. This is a five ton package unit. They pretty much all have these little test one and test two terminals now. So what you're going to do is you put your jumper on one lead and then again on the other. That's going to put you into test mode. How do you know? You can see your light flashing on your main control board. So now you leave it connected. Our first step was the blower came on. It's going to go through a countdown and it's going to go on to the next function. Next function should be economizer. So let's see if that starts closing. There it is. Shortly after that, it'll go into mechanical cooling. Now at any point you want to stop at that particular mode, you just take the jumper off and it'll stay in that mode. By leaving it on, it's going to go through every step. So what we'll do is once the cooling comes on, we'll let that one cycle through and we'll stop it heating. We're doing a uh, heat inspection today. Brand new unit, I don't know if I mentioned that. The last time you ever seen looking this good. Okay, so now we're kicking into heat mode. Our inducer is going to start. So, we want to stay in that mode. We're going to remove one side of our test terminal. And it's going to stay here until we bump it onto the next stage or reset. And again, like I said, you can stop that at any step along the way to stay in that mode. So if we go one more, I'm just going to go back to the, to the beginning and shut down. Pretty simple. Very, uh, very easy way to go through all your stages. Alright man, see you at the next time.